Lockdown, people. Let's get this challenge started. Teams, take a prisoner from the competition. And Chef, I mean, Warden, lock him up. It's in the bag. Gwen owes us. But what if locking her up means she's out of the challenge, though? But we can't know, remember? We need this bag. Let's flip a coin. Heads, we win. Tails, victory is ours. Remember when Lindsay locked herself in the bathroom? She lost it. Drank everyone's shampoos in case any of them were magic potions, and then barfed on herself. She'll crack for sure. Choices? Gaffers? Lindsay. Yay, I win! Grips. Now remember, this is an important choice, especially for perennial losers like yourselves. Oh, we shouldn't have any trouble beating Gwen. Today's first game is the Prison Challenge. Each team of prison chefs whips up the foulest, nastiest, most barf-inducing slop this side of Alcatraz. Gwen and Lindsay have to stomach as much as they can. Last one to power hurl. Wins! I... I can't! I'm innocent, I tell you! Innocent! That's what they all say. Gross! Oh, no! The reward better be worth it. Have I ever let you down? Wait, scratch that. Anyway, prisoners ready? And... Colonite! Duncan goes right for the roaches. Harold tops it off with some slimy anchovy paste. And oh, here come the horse lips. Where do you even get these things? They're obviously imported. Gosh. How's a self-respecting chef supposed to serve that? Mama Spice. And Mama would be proud, I think. Nice work, Ben. I knew I could count on you. Ah. <laughs> uh. A whole lot of dead hair going into the grips concoction. Oh, and what's this? On top of spaghetti, all covered in flakes. And Gwen has to eat it, cause them's just the breaks. Time's up, and jailbirds, hope your appetites are primed. Feeling queasy? We have the braised horse lips with the goat brains fricassee and the fish gut reduction. Topped off, of course, with the toenail clippings. Bon appetit. Horse lips are low fat and low carb, right? Are you maggots ready? One minute to down that chow. And dig in. I was imagining every horrifying, barf-worthy thing I could. Drinking the janitor's mop water. The time my brother puked on my neck on the tilt-a-whirl when I was babysitting and the dog ate the kids' diapers and then licked my face. But nothing was working. Wow, that's delicious. It's like I'm eating an angel's wings. Mm. Thanks, my dad would have killed me. Gwen keeps it down for the screaming gaffers and wins the reward. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Ah, don't worry, Gwen. You and your gaffers have the golden shovel. They'll be thanking you in the elimination challenge. <laughs>